Yeah, Jarly getting back into the swing of things in 1v1. Up against it today. Versus the inform Naipo, who's faked once, twice, and scores. You know, in only interviewing people like Lionel Messi and, like I said, selling out the new camp. You know, nothing too crazy. So, Drally being tested here. Naipo with a little bit of better boost management. And yeah, he looked very, very, very good while doing it. And here comes the best chance of the game yet for Drally. And he slots it over the top of Naipo's early challenge. Good awareness here by Drally to see. Uh, Naipo coming. Just a simple ceiling shot for Drally. Already in the conversation for best player in the world. And that might sound crazy um, if you weren't around at the time to to watch that or to watch Rocket League back then. But genuinely, Scrub Killer was in the conversation for best player in the world at that time. Um, in week in small weekly tournaments in to the challenge like he usually does. That really made it difficult for Drally to get the ball past him. No, Drally, Naipo's done just that. 4-2. Aerial control out of this world. Um, fans saying it like I think that is a very unique type of hype um, that is has no comparison as well. I don't think Scrubbers then have either of them have a comparison. The, what they've the type of hype they've got was so different just yet. Drally just stole them all. Like, Drally looks like he might have missed his reset there, perhaps jumping off the ball too early. That gives Naipo a very easy turnover of possession. Slams the shot straight at Drally, who keeps it out the initial hit and also recover at the same time. Drally's hit the post here. It's not going to bounce too kindly for him, but he does well to read it. I think the loser between uh, Rule 1 and Falcons between Worlds and Gamers 8 will probably be taking a long, hard look at Naipo as an individual. Confirms the Game 1 victory. Not a bad showing there by Drally. Uh, Spring Major. Powers Player Fever. I believe leaked every... Again, he must have accidentally clicked public or something, or maybe the, uh, the automatic computer the settings of his PC. Had, had that uh, just happen, unfortunately. <laughs> I don't know, did you guys hear the result of uh, Power vs Vitality Scribs? If I'm not mistaken, Power won five games out of eight against Vitality. So obviously, Europe sucks. Europe's terrible. Um, OCE. Uh, some more replays if you guys want to do that. Do you guys want to do that? One in chat if that sounds like an interesting um, thing to do after this. Drally's actually giving Naipo a nice shot here. If you look at what Naipo's done. Looks like just a flip reset, but he actually flies in front of the ball angle needed to generate quite a lot of power. And then the shot likewise. Drally with a good read that it was hitting the post. Naipo trying to keep the pressure on here. He knows he's got Drally very low on boost. Now he takes the ball pretty efficiently forward. A little bit of boost left over. That's all he needed to really crumble, even if his opponent does win one or two against him. Here comes Drally though. Not a lot of boost, but the air dribble's threatening and he goes with the underdog and puts it past. Naipo, who defended from the back wall. Naipo clearly expected Drally to have a bit more boost here. Drally just dropped it under. Not want to give too many chances to the side Arabian, but that is an unbelievable first touch. Drally gets back to it though, and he's got the back corner boost as well. Maybe an open net for Drally. Indeed it is. And that's going to be a two goal lead. Good King of the Hill. I mean, I don't think a Chronic plays any 1v1, so it wouldn't really work, I think. But maybe one day if we can come up with something. You know, the teams that would daylights out of Exotic and Itachi, although actually Exotic does have a bit of one's background. Um, it's actually not so much. Starting off game three with a big challenge also. Naipo doesn't look comfortable here. Drally in reverse. Rattles has a bunch of videos of him beating AJ in 1v1. Actually, yeah, maybe Optic would be a good one because Rattles does have 1v1 background. Magic Bear has 1v1 background. Still Drally off the possession. Here's the back corner boost for himself. It's a very efficient approach. Naipo's got so much boost to play with, and it's just too easy for him. I mean, even if he gets a 50-50 here, he's got 23 boosts left over. I mean, that, that's just a perfect end-to-end -end air dribble. It's notice, even if Drally gets a 50 on this... Oh, that's a bit close to, to the center there for Naipo. Drally's shot lacking a lot of power, though. Naipo will counter with the boost advantage that he's got. Can't make any promises, because I don't know yet the uh, exact... Dates. Did I say low boost? What did I? What was I supposed to say? That's quite funny. If I just completely misspoke. Let me once. Imagine. Oh, good turn by Drally. Well, that was a very, very surprising turn. That gave a long range air dribble a go. Free flip at the end of it. He bumps Naipo and accidentally, I think, knocks him into the ball. So that ends up being a save. Not a bad try though by Drally. Fortunately, you know, boost starving your opponent, managing your own boost, uh, trying to 
make sure to. Yeah, I know a lot of people immediately think that, oh, nice control by Naipo. It, it would just be harder to really do anything. Oh, what a lob. My goodness, these flip resets from Naipo are so hard to stop. Durali reads a lower shot here because Naipo's got a reset, but then it looks like he's flying down to the ground there to catch the ball. Durali, a flip reset of his own. Oh, the flick goes under Naipo. He's dove a bit too high off the back wall there. No, no doubt Durali Dr uh, was expecting this to go a bit higher. He was looking to flick this one um, into the roof of the net. But it fell off the front of this defensive play. Naipo with another frighteningly good first touch. Lean back reset. Dunks on the clear. Boost steal comes through. And Naipo slots it at the near post. In fact, that is, is has a similar effect to playing with unlimited boost. And the, oh, nice shot there by Durali. How's he managed to bump Naipo there? I'm not sure. We'll have to look at the replay. Yeah, you, you might think that, oh well, it's, it's just better because we're no kickoff goals. Kickoff goals boring. What's a bump? Oh, off before it can get started. And here comes Rally again. A bit more time. Naipo deflects the flick into the bar and it bounces downwards. Oh, he's been pit maneuvered off the back corner boost there. Just has to lob a soft shot on target. Rally easily retakes control. Naipo with the ball chase turn challenge. That was extremely quick. And Rally did not see it coming. If you have just tuned in, Midway through this match, Drally's looking very good. Naipo looks inevitable. Drally finds a way through though, 1-1. First shot was good enough to just get a bad recovery out of Naipo. Uh, no, but I don't know if that's even been posted, so I, 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 won't, I wouldn't say I did either way. This time Naipo goes underneath Drally. He's mixed up his flip reset offense so well today. Let's think about how many times in the last game Drally will territory now, Pope. Drally needs to match him, but his flip reset dunk gets deflected away from danger. Now, Pope, back to Europe with a perfect split at the end of the Spring Major this uh, upcoming week. Oh, that's a big mistake by now, Pope. Drally has not had too many looks at goal this game. Just to you know, become more well-rounded over time. I think Naipo being one of them, this guy was not really known for his defense when he first surfaced as a one's talent. Then now he's just a complete monster in every aspect of the game. Absolute boom there. Look how quickly that sequence. All right now, this is insane. I, I, I always try and mention this for anyone who does come back and watch the VOD from the moment that ads came on for them. I can only say if I apologize, try to prevent that from happening. Naipo wants Drally to commit because with a minute left at some point, Drally will have to go all in. Before Naipo goes all in, Drally's got a wide open net here if he can put it in quickly, which he does. Drally dribbling straight towards his opponent. Air dribble bump commencing and it lands, 5-5. Five, five. I know a lot of you guys who've watched my stream and watched my channel for a while, you'll know that that is one of the biggest tells that an air dribble bites to grab hundreds. One reset for Naipo. Decides to go low. He's got the ball underneath Drally, but it does not bounce into a strikeable position immediately. Drally's back to keep it out and then to keep it up. We're not done with this regulation time play. It's Drally. He's passed the challenge and resets to the open net. We're going to game five. What a defensive stand by Drally. And what an outplay in the midfield. Nepo thought you could surprise him. Drally heard him coming and he will equalize the series. <laughs> what a play that was. Right, but then it stayed up. Um, and Naipo thought, well, I don't want to have to defend a Drally zero second air. He, he made, you know, a, the play he made was fair enough. It was a sneaky challenge, but full credit to Drally from his um, home in Saudi Arabia. Drally's in Morocco, so this is also very uh, expected for him to have 50, 60 ish. Um, neither player, just how impressive it is that the Middle Eastern players, the African players, can. Play as well as they do with the yeah they've heard that we're coming so they're obviously very excited about that hard they might, hard they might even make like the you know since we, that's the day that we're going to be arriving setting foot in boston they, i heard they're going to make it into some kind of holiday uh some kind of vacation long term which is you know an honor um as as just a roughly commentary could win this brought his a game today decides not to commit with that play don't think he had a reset there Oh, what a read by Naipo. Drally looking to send that into the back corner. Naipo one step ahead of him. Spotted exactly what Drally had planned. Accelerated into the middle, says great. 
And it looks like it's going to be a good one. That's a perfect first touch. Now Po lunging forward. Drally gets it past him, but it's into the bar. And now Po's recovery is good. Where's the ball going? Actually bouncing on target. Oh my goodness. Feeling like a, a snooker commentator there. Where's the cue ball going? Vibes, but that is some bounce. My goodness, that is perfect pickup in the mid boost on spawn. They actually got to set up the shot. It was not the best one. Drally able to crunch through the challenge. Yeah, we've got a real one versus complexity show match tomorrow. After this stream, I'm going to uh, tweet that one out. Um, I believe. Well, that fake kickoff did not work out at all for Drally. Tried to half flip away from the ball. Now, Poe just wave dashes under it and flicks it with no boost. Drally knows that boost isn't going to spawn for a while, so he's going to need to sit on this. Just takes a little breather. There it is. That corner steals the boost away. Goes again. Now, Poe sitting underneath the ball here. Not a comfortable position. Drally ties the game. Now, but did not have a way to put the challenge in. Pathing round underneath the ball for small pads. Before he could throw a statement comeback for Drally. Going the distance. Nepo trying to hold on to his spot. as a convincing top five in the world. And there. Dangerous flip by Drally. Leaves himself wide open for the demo. Nepo plays for the catch on the ground. Drally just about got enough on that. Recovery is good. Actually, Naupo does not have a lot of boost left over. Drally's going to score off this. Well, Naupo secures mid boost. Both players have 100 here. Or had 100. Naupo's actually used half of his. Drally slow plays in near post. Oh, what a mind game. He takes the lead with 24 seconds left. And it's Naupo who's in a very awkward position. Expected Drally to be going higher here. And in form Naupo. And here comes the Saudi Arabian. He's got enough boost to take this to the sidewall, which he does. It's going to need to be a zero second goal. Fake ceiling challenge for Drally. Naupo from the ground. Looking to get the ball past Drally. I think he has, but Drally's got so much boost left over. Manages to grind it. Drally takes it. What a series. What a return for Drally. He's been out of the limelight for a while, but I think he's back. This was a solid performance. Start to finish.